ガジェットクッキング、いろいろ試行錯誤しながら頑張ってます。今まで日本で何をやってきたかというと今僕は65歳ですけども45年間の料理経験がありますいろいろなレストランをやってきたし会社もいろいろやってきましたそれでいい時もあり悪い時もありいろんな経験をしてきましたその中で培ってきた僕の料理のノウハウを皆さんにお伝えしますどんなレストランをやってきたかというとカフェから始まりレストラン24時間営業のレストランをやりましたスパゲティレストラン寿司屋さんカレー屋さん焼肉屋さんうどん屋さん餃子専門店ラーメン屋さんラーメン屋さんは70軒作りましたそして今はフィリピンでたこ焼き屋をやっていますいろいろなレストランの経験をあなたに教えますだからこの料理をもしあなたがちゃんと習得すれば本当の日本料理をあなたが覚えたことになりますぜひ頑張ってやってくださいはい、今日は日本で最も有名な丼料理の一つの親子丼を作りますこれは知らない日本人はいません親子丼は最も有名な丼料理ですこれを教えますから頑張って作ってください Oyakodon is a donburi or Japanese rice bowl dish in which chicken, eggs, sliced scallions, and other ingredients are simmered together in a kind of sauce which is made with soy sauce and stock and then stirred on top of a large bowl of rice. Oyakodon was first created at Nihonbashi, Japan in 1891. The name Oyakodon came from the ingredients because Oya, the parent, represents the chicken and the court child represents the egg. So, for ingredients today, for sauce, we need 30 grams of soy sauce, 10 grams of sake, vinegar, 7 grams of sugar, and 2 grams of oyster sauce and hondashi. And for this, we need 2 eggs and 1 egg for hot spring eggs, and 80 grams of chicken, 1 quart of onion, rice, and spring onions. So, now we're going to prepare our hot boiling water in our empty instant ramen cup. And we're going to put our egg in the cup and pour the water till the marked line in the cup. And then we're going to let it sit for 20 minutes. And while we wait, we're going to cut our chicken into small cubes. And now for the onion, we're going to take off the skin and take off the center of the onion. And we're going to cut it into thin slices. And now in the pan, we're going to add our water, soy sauce, vinegar, sake, sugar, hondashi, oyster sauce, stir and let it boil in high heat. A few minutes later. Once it starts to boil, turn off the heat and let it sit. Once it's done, we're going to let it cool in cold water. A few minutes later. And now we're going to cook it into a bowl and let it sit. And now in a non stick pan, we're going to cook our chicken and our onions. And once it looks like this, we're going to crack two eggs in a bowl, scramble it, and pour our sauce. Keep a little sauce for later. And let it cook until the sauce starts to boil. And now we're going to pour our scrambled eggs around the pan. And cover for a minute. A few minutes later. Once it's done, we're going to put it on the rice. And we're going to add our hot spring eggs in the middle. 
and pour the excess sauce on the egg. And lastly, garnish with green onions. Já viu rico namorar pobre? later. dressing and the sweetness from the onion really goes well. It's so good. Let's try breaking the yolk. Mm. Okay. Now I'm going to dip the caramelized onion with the yolk. Wow, it looks so good. <laughs> It's so good. The richness from the egg is like so good. I'll try with the tofu. Mmm. Oh wow, it's good. Once you eat it, you can't stop it. It's so good. So today we're eating the oyakodon. Yay! It's so good. Oh wow. Look at that like hot spring egg. Today, today's Oyakodon is kind of different because we have this onsen tamago, which is a uh, onsen tamago. It's onsen tamago. <laughs> it's like it's close to a poached egg, but it is. Uh, no, it is. It is a poached egg. But it it's is. in the Japanese because it's different. Yeah, the name is different, but but it's a poached egg. So we have yeah. poached egg and oyakodon. Okay. So who's gonna try? Me. Oh, gonna break the egg. And okay. Yeah. All you should see me break the egg. Okay. Okay. Go. Oh, uh, yeah, that's right. Look at that, it's so golden. It's sweet and savory. The richness from the egg really goes well. It's so good. I really like the sauce. It's so good. It's sweet and savory. A lot of Filipino people put oil in the chicken when you fry the chicken and onions. You don't actually put it, so it actually tastes the chicken itself. This is the Japanese classic. It's so good. Everybody knows what oyakodon is, and it's so famous. Mm -hmm. This is so good, guys. Mm -hmm. 
So thank you guys for watching this video. Please subscribe, like, and comment, and go hit that link button so you can get more notifications from us. And you should really try making this. It's so good. It's just like the classic. You should try it and then, you know, experience the Japanese flavors of the goodness, you know? So I hope you enjoy and try cooking at home. Thanks for watching and see you next time. Yeah. Bye! Thank you guys for watching. Please subscribe, like, and comment. And go hit that link button so you can get more notifications from us. And go follow our Instagram and Facebook for more information. Thank you!